Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are hunting for strawberry and banana prime. It recently came out in Iceland. I'm at my local Iceland and also B&M. Can't lie, I think I'm a few days late to this. Basically, I ended up going to Paris on, when was it, a couple nights ago. We went to Paris just for one night. So we flew there, came back. I'm literally, I had two hours sleep last night. Today I'm running on only a few hours sleep, so I'm very tired. So I think it came out in Iceland a couple of days ago and I'm quite late to this because people have been commenting saying, Shivani, it's out, you haven't found it yet, but yeah. I'm here now, so let's go find it. Also, the worst feeling ever is when you land back from holiday, come back to the UK, and you get weather like this. I don't know if you can see it. It's just raining everywhere. Ah, I love the UK weather so much. But yeah, I might insert a little vlog here just so you guys can see my time in Paris. I also Snapchat vlog the whole entire thing. So if you guys want to keep up to date with my life, come and follow me on Snapchat. My username's on the screen down there. But yeah, let's start. I'm going to start off by going to B&M. I need to put my hood up because I just washed my hair and I don't want to get rainwater in it. Let's start off going to B&M. Then we'll try Iceland. There's also an Audi around the corner. I don't know. I don't know if Prime's out in Audi yet, but apparently it's also coming to Audi. But yeah, I'm super excited to test this out, see what it tastes like. Strawberry banana Prime. No idea. I've had the USA one, but that was a f like a few weeks ago. I don't know what the UK one is going to taste like. The hood looks so weird. It's the weirdest shaped hood I've ever worn in my whole life. Um, let's run it into B&M right now and see if they have it. Do I have my car keys? Yeah, I do. Okay. Very empty today. Like, there's not many people here, which is good. So I'm hoping you guys haven't taken all the strawberry banana primes. Store number one. There's people shouting over there. I don't know if there's like a fight going on. I have no idea. Literally full on shouting. I don't think you can hear it though. Okay, B&M first stop. Let's go have a look. Oh my God, guys, I tried barbecue and sauce the other day it just came out and it was probably the worst thing i've tried in my whole entire life it was bright pink and it was awful what's this apparently they have some new red bull flavors as well i think it's like i don't actually know it's like a green bottle and then a pink one as well i get too carried away in being and they have so much cool stuff here okay okay right here's some primes why is strawberry watermelon though why have you got this and not the new flavor what's the point no not true oh my god yeah they have these as well they have these like four packs. These are brand new. Um, oh. Six pound though, four. Wait, if they're two pound each, you save two pounds. You can get them in packs now. I saw these on, on TikTok. You can get strawberry and watermelon and lemonade. I don't think they have any other ones though, but yeah. But if you, I never remembered if I tried these ones or not. I can't remember. But yeah, there's no actual strawberry and banana prime here, which is fine because it's literally in Iceland next door. I didn't think they had them here anyway, I just wanted to quickly check. Do they have the Red Bull flavours? No. Quick little plug for myself, I stream Fortnite custom lobbies, do hide and seek and Simon Says, and then just normal zero build lobbies every single night at 6pm on Twitch, so make sure you guys join. Okay, I'm done in this shop, I don't really need anything to be honest. Um, sun cream? Nah, it's not even sunny in the country. Uh, yeah, let's head on down next door then. I know exactly where the prime is. And it's not looking good. I don't think I see it. These are new as well, I feel like. They literally don't have it here. I don't know why. They only have Arsenal Prime. Okay, wait. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. There's also a drink section. I'm gonna go check the actual drink section as well. There's actually none here. I'll check the front of the shop as well. It's not looking like a good day for us today, guys. Hmm. No, literally, Arsenal. So much Arsenal and no strawberry and banana prime. I've barely had any sleep, so my plan today, <laughs> I'm being a bit lazy, I can't lie, was to come here, find it, then I was meant to meet my friend at a coffee shop now to edit the video and get it posted. If you're watching this today, yeah, the time is currently 12.48 p.m. and I need to get this video filmed, edited and posted by 4 p.m. So hopefully I did it on time and you guys are watching this right now, but um, yeah. So now my plans have changed. So instead I'm going to another Iceland on the high street and back to sneeze. I feel like I'm getting sick as well. Oh my God. I'm good. I'm okay. I'm, I'm gonna go to another Iceland. It's about a 20, no, it's 50 minute drive to get to the high street, park the car up and go inside Iceland. And hopefully they have it. I'm a bit disappointed because this is like a massive Iceland. They didn't even have the strawberry banana, like the tag on the shelf, which means they haven't even stocked up yet. But I've seen so many people try it. So why do they not have it? Doesn't matter, let's drive to the next one. I'll see you guys there soon. I feel like my last few prime hunts have literally been in the same exact shops. Well, it's always been Iceland, right? There haven't been any other places really that have released prime recently apart from Iceland. Audi should be releasing it soon. So I'm sorry for the repetitiveness of my videos, but hopefully you guys still enjoy now in the high street. Um, also, what is with UK weather? Because now it's the most sunny day ever. It was literally raining this morning. I'm literally boiling up. Um, Wilkerson's is shut down. Oh God, it's shut down. 
so many big shops, Mark Spencer shut down, so many big shops in my high street have shut down recently, it's actually really annoying. But this Iceland's kind of new to be fair, it's very annoying, we used to have so many shops on this high street and it used to be a nice place to come to, but recently just everything shut down, ooh Greg, ooh, kind of fancy Greg's you know. But I am going to a coffee shop after this and maybe I'll just get coffee from there. Um, let's see if it's in the door again. We literally came here last week, guys. I'm actually so irritated. I came here last week. If they don't have it again, I'm going to actually cry to the Iceland workers. I'm going to cry to them. I see Prime and I'm not going to lie, it's not looking good. I see Cherry Freeze. I see Cherry Freeze. That's all the Prime. Let's check. Let me ask someone. Hi, do you have the strawberry and banana Prime flavour? Yeah. You do? Oh, he said yeah. Maybe it's down the other end. Oh, in the drink section. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Guys, they have it here. I don't know why. When I saw it at the front shop, I was like, yeah, they definitely don't have it. Because why would they put it? Fourth aisle. Fourth aisle. Fourth aisle. I'm in the fourth aisle. I said it's here in the fourth aisle. I don't see it. Unless I've missed it. There's no prime here. Huh? Let me check around this corner. Bro, unless it's at the front of the shop, I'm I'm lost. Is I see it now. I see you by the till there. Oh, they're over here. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Guys, I have so many here. I feel like the bottle looks different to the USA ones. Like different colours. It's yellow on the bottom, orange. I feel like was the other bottle yellow at the top. I don't know. They got loads here anyway. So I'm gonna pick up a few bottles. They are two pound each. I'm gonna go back to the car and we'll taste test them. And they've got Arsenal Prime here as well. But yeah, let me pick up a few of these and we'll see what they taste like. I'm so happy we actually found it. So here's what the bottle looks like. It looks very similar. To, I, f I don't know why. I feel like the American bottle had yellow on the top and pink at the bottom, but maybe maybe I'm tripping. It just says on the bottle, strawberry banana flavor drink with vitamins, potassium and sweetness. Can you guys see that? Is it pinky? It's like an orange color, but I feel like that's a reflection of the yellow. It's kind of pinky drink. Let's try it. It smells like strawberry. I don't smell any banana in that. You know what? That's surprisingly not as bad as I thought it would be. I can't lie, I didn't think it would be that great because obviously the thought of banana juice is a bit like mm, you don't really get banana flavoured drinks, right? I don't know, do you? Comment down below if you've ever seen a banana flavoured drink but I've never seen one ever. This one actually tastes decent though. I'm not going to lie, I'm a fan of that. Is it one of my favourite prime flavours? No, I'll be honest, it's not out there with like ice pop or orange. It is kind of a refreshing like summery type vibe. It's not as sweet as other flavours. I kind of prefer the Meta Moon and Ice Pop, the sweet flavours. It's not as sweet as them, but it's still got like some sweetness in it. But yeah, it's actually decent. I quite like that, to be fair. If I saw this on the shelf, I think I would buy it if it's like a hot day, because it is refreshing. But I wouldn't pick it over like Ice Pop or Orange or some other flavours. But it's better than Tropical, Lemon Lime, Blue Raspberry. I think it's the same level as Blue Raspberry, to be honest. Let me know if you guys have tried it down below and let me know what you guys thought it tasted like because I'm trying to think and I can't really think of the taste. Uh, it's really hard to describe it. I don't know. It's just I've never tasted a drink like that before just because I haven't tried banana juice before, but yeah. Make sure you like, comment and subscribe. Let's get this video to 1,000 likes. I love you guys so much. Can't wait to make more content for you guys. I'm going on holiday again next week, so I will get you guys some travel vlogs and stuff like that. Love you all and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye.